uh, former Louisiana governor and presidential candidate Bobby Jindal uh, supports Marco Rubio. And if you think about it, Governor, one of the things that, that uh, Rubio has been selling is this idea he is a different sort of a bridge candidate that will, will satisfy those who don't quite like Donald Trump, are scared, that is, of, of what a President Cruz could bring. And he is that bridge candidate. And that is how he has been pitching himself and enjoying the big support he's been getting, uh, certainly, uh, you know, from, from powerful figures within South Carolina. Did that help him? Absolutely. And Neil, before I say anything, I've been hearing you plugging Fox Business. I just want to make sure I'm on message. Everybody should be watching Fox Business Network. Good, there you go. Place right. to get you. We're so Not only on election night. We're so getting it done. It took us like 10 minutes to get Gasparino so to message. acknowledge that. But I mean, <laughs> all right, go ahead. Go ahead. Make, up. And follow up with your I, fine point. I, I, and I don't even get paid by Fox Business. I'm just saying that because you guys are such great friends. No, I, I, look, I, I think you're exactly right. You know, I think that one of the reasons that Marco has done so well is, is that he is optimistic. I, I think that, look, I, I think the American voters are angry. I think they're frustrated with D.C. And I think it's one of the reasons Donald Trump and others are doing well. Without ignoring that sentiment, I think Marco recognizes voters are frustrated, but he also says we can do better. You know, better days are ahead of us. He can unify the party. He can attract voters. I know that in the Republican Party, we like to look to Ronald Reagan a lot, and a lot of folks have made comparisons, myself included, between Obama and Carter. You could argue the tough times we're going through now remind a lot of folks of what we went through in the 70s. Reagan, Reagan lifted the spirits of the American people. I think Marco's doing the same thing. I think he is very optimistic. He is conservative. He understands people are frustrated, but he's saying we as a country can do better than we have done these last seven years. It's time to apply these conservative principles and get back on the right path. All right, uh, Governor, thank you very much. I do want